And welcome back to my channel. I hope you're having a wonderful day. So I have some really big news for you. I just launched my shoe collection. Ah! <laughs> oh my goodness, you do not know how long I have been waiting for this. I am so excited to share the designs with you firsthand. And if you've been following me on uh, my blog and Instagram, which if you aren't, why not? <laughs> I share lots of pretty pink inspiration, feminine fashion, beauty, and lifestyle. I think that you would really love it. So make sure to check me out at lizzieandlace.com and lizzieandlace on Instagram. But anyway, if you follow me on those platforms, then you have seen the process unfold. I've been doing little updates on my Instagram stories. I'll leave a link in the description if you want to um, see that process. But it has been really exciting and they have been been on pre-sale for um, a few months now and they finally just officially launched and I wanted you to be the very first to see what the designs look like. So here they are in the flesh and it has been so amazing to see them go from inspiration to drawing to actual product that you can wear. It's just such an incredible process and um, I'm just really really excited. So both of these are sneakers which is really really funny because I was never a sneaker girl in fact this is my very first pair of high tops <laughs> and actually my first pair of slip-ons too so that's pretty crazy I mean uh, might as well be your own right so I was never really a sneaker type of person I always wore flats and heels and uh, sandals and that sort of thing and I just found that sneakers were not feminine enough for me. I could never find a pretty sneaker, if you know what I mean. <laughs> so um, when I would go to theme parks or go somewhere where I would be walking around all day, I would wear my flats. And then as I got older, I kind of relished more in comfort. So I traded in my really high heels for lower heels and I still do wear my flats, but I started wearing sneakers with my dresses. And it wasn't until I found my perfect white sneaker that I realized that it could work and it still looks feminine and it doesn't look any less stylish than if you were to wear a normal flat shoe with a dress. So when I was approached with this opportunity, I knew that it was really my chance to create something special and something beautiful and feminine and romantic that people would want to wear and be proud to wear and hopefully be the first shoe that they reach for whenever they're getting ready for the day. I wanted it to be comfortable and feminine and classy and neutral enough to where you could wear it with a lot of different things, but on its own, it's still really bold and unique and you are definitely going to get compliments on it. Both of them are super cute and I hope that you love them as much as I do. So let me go into uh, specifics about both. So let's start with the slip-on and this one actually seems to be the most popular of the two which is so surprising to me because I totally thought it was going to be the high top but this one is already sold out in a few sizes so if this is one that you're interested in um, make sure that you check it out I'll leave some links in the description for both shoes so it has this gorgeous floral print and it is printed on white canvas and it is absolutely dreamy. So the flowers are like a light pink with um, a darker pink in the middle and some light green leaves. And then in the back, you have this contrasted blush pink. Um, it's kind of like a neutral blush pink. So it's very, very light, but it really goes well with the floral print. And inside you have uh, the insole, which is very, very padded. They are super comfortable, really easy to walk in. And then you also have the rubber bottom. And there's padding along the sides as well and some elastic at the front for easy slip on and off. They go with so many different things. Um, since these are lower down, these would go well with so many different 
lengths of dresses and skirts. You can wear them with minis, middies, maxis, pretty much anything. And they also look really cute with shorts and jeans and pretty much everything else. So I think that this is a really good um, shoe that goes with everything. And then this one is the high top version. I think it is adorable. So it has the same beautiful floral print on the white canvas. And then right here it has just the plain white canvas and it goes all the way up. It comes with two different laces. It comes with plain white and then also black. And the back has a really nice leather detail. And the interior also has the same padded insole it's very 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 comfortable and then you also have a slightly different bottom on these so this floral print was actually inspired by a vintage floral print if you didn't know I collect a lot of vintage items including handkerchiefs and jewelry and that sort of thing and so those two things were the main inspiration I have these really pretty light pink floral uh, clip-on earrings that I absolutely adore and then my mom actually gave me one of my great-grandmother's handkerchiefs and it was this really gorgeous floral print and so I kind of mixed the two together and I knew that I wanted to have a white background and a really light pink floral so that it would pair well with a lot of things and just look really really pretty on its own and that is what I came up with and originally I actually wanted to put pink ribbon laces on the high top and I'm still going to get some <laughs> so I found some really cute ones that I think would look really adorable with the shoe and I will link them below if you are interested. And uh, yeah, I'm really excited to see what they look like on because I think they're just going to add so much more cuteness to the shoe. I just found a pink ribbon and quickly put it on here so you can kind of see the look that I'm going for. It's super, super cute. Ideally, it would probably be a little bit thicker, but it's still adorable. Also, did you notice that the floral print actually matches my dress? <laughs> I wore this dress specifically for this reason <laughs> but anyway so when they came in I actually shared them with my husband my mom and a few other family members just to get their thoughts because I have no experience with this type of shoe since this is the very first one I owned and my husband has tons of this style shoe and so does my mom and everyone said that they were extremely well made the fabric is amazing the print is really beautiful they have a lot of um, padding in the insole which I guess isn't normal for this type of shoe and let me tell you they really are comfortable <laughs> and um, that overall like they are just a really really beautiful shoe and everyone said that they wanted them for themselves which makes me so so happy <laughs> um, so sizing wise I would say that these are true to size so just get your normal size and then the high tops I am normally a size 6 and they were pretty snug on me so I think if you wear socks or just want a uh, more comfortable fit I would probably go up half a size so I actually just got a size six and a half in and they fit me much much better and I do have the option of wearing socks with them if I want um, so just keep that in mind and lastly I do want to mention that this is a very very limited edition collection with only 50 pairs being available total so if this is something that you love then make sure you check them out I will leave links for both pairs in the description below and if you ordered them during pre-sale firstly thank you so 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 much for your support and secondly I would really love to know your honest thoughts about the shoe overall so feel free to DM me or comment or even email me and let me know I would really really be interested in hearing that so I think that that's it today I do have something really special um, going up on Instagram so make sure that you check that out today <laughs> and I think that that's it for this video if you liked it please make sure to hit the thumbs up below and um, please leave a comment below letting me know your thoughts I would love to hear what you think and feel free to subscribe and share as that always really helps me out and if you want to see even more pretty pink girly content make sure you check out my blog lizzieinlace.com and my pretty pink instagram at lizzieinlace 
I will see you next time. Bye.